Hey, good morning. I just want to show you guys real quick the right way to install an acorn fitting on a uh, ground rod. I see this done backwards a lot of the time, so I just thought I'd do a quick video to show you all what to do. All right, so just uh, for some context, what we're doing is we got the CT meter can for the power company. We're installing a number six, maybe it's a number four ground. It's hard to tell for me with the solid wire, but we're installing uh, that ground down to hit a ground rod right here, all right? And so what I see guys do a lot, usually it's the newbies, but you have an acorn clamp, which has, you know, this side here that has the bolt, and then the side here that's a little bit rounded. The wire should sit between the ground rod and the rounded side, and the bolt should clamp down against the ground rod. Okay, so a few things I gotta do here with this. First off is just sort of clean off the dirt, some dirt on the outside of this ground rod. So I'm gonna do that real quick. I'm gonna do that real quick, and then I'll just show you the way this uh, should look when it's done. Okay, so first things first, I'll show you guys how I see it more frequently than I would expect. As you can see how the bolt is up against the wire here. And the problem with that is, um, for one, as you twist this, this wire will tend to want to move off the bolt to the side. And so then you might end up with it actually looking like this. And then you'll have a loose connection. So that's the wrong way. So here's the right way. The right way has the mechanical connection on one side of the ground rod. And then the wire on the other side sandwiched right like that. And then that's not going anywhere. 